incredible. One of the worst performances of my career, and they never doubted it for a second. How could I possibly be expected to handle school on a day like this? This is my ninth sick day this semester. It's getting pretty tough coming up with new illnesses. If I go for 10, I'm probably gonna have to barf up a lung. So I better make this one count. The key to faking out the parents is the clammy hands. It's a good non-specific symptom. I'm a big believer in it. A lot of people will tell you that a good phony fever is a dead lock, but uh, you get a nervous mother, you could wind up in a doctor's office. That's worse than school. You fake a stomach cramp, and when you're bent over, moaning and wailing, you lick your palms. It's a little childish and stupid, but then so is high school. Life moves pretty fast. If you don't stop and look around once in a while, you could miss it. I do have a test today. That wasn't bullshit. It's on European socialism. I mean, really, what's the point? I'm not European. I don't plan on being European. So who gives a crap if they're socialists? They could be fascist anarchists. It still wouldn't change the fact that I don't own a car. I recall Central Park in fall. How you tore your dress. What a mess, I confess. Not that I condone fascism, or any ism for that matter. Isms, in my opinion, are not good. If a person should not believe in an ism, he should believe in himself. I quote John Lennon, I don't believe in Beatles, I just believe in me. A good point there. After all, he was the walrus. I could be the walrus, I'd still have to bum rides off of people. They bought it. Incredible. One of the worst performances in my career, and he never doubted it for a second. I possibly be expected to handle school on a day like this. It's a test. It's a test. This is my ninth sick day this semester. It's getting pretty tough coming up with new illnesses. If I'm gonna go for 10, I'm probably gonna have to barf up a lung. So I better make this one count. The key to faking out the parents is the clammy hands. It's a good non-specific symptom. I'm a big believer in it. A lot of people will tell you that a good phony fever is a deadlock, but you get a nervous mother and you'll wind up in a doctor's office, and that's worse than school. You fake a stomach cramp, and when you're bent over, moaning and wailing, you lick your palms. It's a little childish and stupid, but then, so is high school. Life moves pretty fast. If you don't stop and look around every once in a while, you can miss it. I do have a test today. It wasn't bullshit. It's on European socialism. And I mean, really, what's the point? I'm not European. I don't plan on being European. So, who gives a crap if they're socialists? They could be fascist anarchists, and it still wouldn't change the fact that I don't have a car. As I recall, Central Park in fall. How you tore your dress? What a mess. It's not like I condone fascism or any ism for that matter. Ism, in my opinion, are not good. People shouldn't believe in isms, but they should believe in themselves. To quote John Lennon, I don't believe in Beatles, I believe in me. Good point there. He was the walrus after all. 
could be the walrus, but I still bomb rides off people. 